everyone. Um, I'm really cold again. It is nine degrees outside where I am facing south and I'm freezing. I hope you all are warmer than me. Um, so this is just the drop in for week three to see how you are all traveling. Um, last night we had our first um, question and answer session with myself and Layla regarding um, assignment one. It went really well. Um, the recording I put up in an announcement for you all. Um, I think I showed a few tips in regards to how to use multiple sources and multiple references to make a point, which can kind of save words and save time. Um, a lot of you kind of got a lot out of that, so please feel free to check the recording. Um, in the media gallery as well, just pointing your attention to that as well. We also have our videos up for A1. Um, please take a look at those. I've already noticed that a lot of you already have watched them, so that makes me really happy. Um, next week we have the Pop-Up Museum, which informs uh, the second part of, of A1. Um, I'm looking forward to seeing how you all go with that. Um, I will be putting up, some of you have already started, Grace, thank you, and Kylie, which is really, really awesome. Some monuments and some pictures and some really good um, artifacts that show connection to community and show and elicit information about working with communities. I'm really looking forward to that. I'm going to put up my own as well, my own cultural artifact or community artifact for you all as well and talk about it. Um, I may as well um, try using a bit of scholarship, some Taylor, Wenger, some of the critical sources from the unit so far in weeks one, two, three and four to show you a bit um, of reflective writing and how I do that just as an additional tool. Um, probably tomorrow I will be putting up another exemplar for the unit as a whole, both group one and group two, um, in regards to reflective writing for A1 and be doing a bit of a commentary, a live commentary in regards to how, um, uh, what I liked about it, what I think the student did well, what they could improve on and how they are using, um, the kind of the tropes or the different styles of reflective writing to really talk about their community, the map of me and their community artifact. Okay, cool. See you.